Hey guys, I quickly wanted to share the steps that I take with my powders in the areas of my pitted acne scars. I have a video on my whole makeup routine that I will link right here that you can watch later if you haven't seen that yet. This question came from one of my subscribers and I wanted to make a video on it so I can help her out. I just applied my foundation and my pit and acne scars are primarily around my cheek area. So I wanted to show you an extra step that I take with powder. After I do my foundation, I set my entire face with a colorless powder and I'm using the RCMA No Color Powder. So I apply that with a brush all over, excuse me, all over my face, just a little bit. So after my whole entire face is set with a no color powder, I go in with a foundation powder. And I only apply it in the areas of my pitted acne scars. I do this step because I noticed that when I go over my foundation with a blush or a bronzer, only using the like translucent powder, then my scars appear a lot darker. So I started doing this step just to add like an extra layer of coverage underneath the bronzer or blush. Make sure you use a powder that's lighter than your foundation because powder on top of foundation usually will look a lot darker, especially if you have oily skin. So that's gonna defeat the whole purpose if that's the case. And then I'll apply my bronzer or blush. Of course, if your scarring is not in the areas that you apply bronzer or blush, then you can skip this step altogether. Or if you don't wanna use bronzer or blush, then you don't need to do that either. But I just wanted to share this because I noticed a difference on my overall look when I do that little step. Not a huge difference like I say in all my videos because makeup can't hide texture, but it is a little bit of an improvement and I will take anything. So that's it. Thanks for watching. See you next time.